can probably tell by the title of this video, this is going to be a DIY shorts. And this is just the way that I've been making my shorts. I think I've done three pairs so far, actually four or five. But some of them have kind of slowly, I overuse my shorts, especially in the summer. This is just the way that I do my shorts. I don't usually add so much bleach as you guys probably see from the video. Usually I just do the cutting and stuff and then just throw it in the wash. But this time I wanted to try something different. I wanted I wanted to kind of add like this more edgier acid looking shorts, kind of ombre in a way. So yeah, that's what I did. You don't always have to do the bleach like I said, but if you want just plain distressed shorts, this is what you're going to do. So first you're going to need a pair of pants and then you're going to want to cut them about half an inch from your desired length. So in the end, how long you want them, cut them half an inch longer and then later if you need it shorter you can cut them. You're also going to need a pair of sharp scissors and some dull scissors and some pliers. You're also going to need a sponge brush and a brush with separated bristles. You will also need a container for the bleach and some bleach. So starting off, I'm taking the dull scissors and I'm just creating little slits on the bottom, just regular little lime slits, not too big because they will get bigger after the wash. Now I'm going to create some scratches by just opening the scissors and just creating these lines. Uh, make sure you're not using sharp scissors because if you are, it'll probably go straight through the shorts. Now I'm creating slits on the top of the shorts and the reason I'm making them a little bigger here is because the pocket is underneath. So if they get too big after the wash, they'll be perfect because they'll hide anything that's underneath. So now I'm also just adding any little cuts wherever I feel like it'll make it look more natural and like I actually wore these shorts a whole lot. I'm also adding more scratches. You can pretty much add these anywhere you would like. So now taking my pliers, I'm just going to pinch some of the fabric just again to give it that more natural look. So now onto the pockets. Back here I'm going to create this fringe on one of the pockets. So I'm just going to do that by creating a lot of little slits and then just cutting off the top of it which will make for a more fringe like effect so yeah you can do that to the whole part I just decided I wanted to do it on a little piece and like I was saying earlier you can add these scratches anywhere you'd like so now I'm taking my dull scissors and I'm making these really tiny hole cuts so now taking your bleach um, here is where you'll either dilute it or not dilute it. I chose to not dilute it to have that more acid wash look to my shorts. And now you literally can put this bleach anywhere you want. You can be creative and draw stuff on your shorts. I personally am not doing that. But I'm going for a more like ombre, somewhat of an ombre look. And then I'm also just adding this anywhere I feel it would look good and it would make it look more unified and distressed. I'm also adding some horizontal lines to add to the effect. And once you've bleached the areas that you've wanted to bleach, you are going to want to throw this into the wash. And 
this is optional, but if you have any extra bleach, you can go ahead and pour that into the bleach area. And once you're done, you should be left with this beautiful piece of shorts. So thank you all for watching. Please make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you like these kinds of videos. It'll just help me know what kind of videos you guys want to see. And also make sure to subscribe to be notified of any of my new videos. And I will talk to you on the next video. Um, like always, if you guys have any questions, comments, concerns, feel free to leave it down below. And I will respond to it as soon as I can. I will talk to you on the next video. Bye.